first of all let us understand the symptoms dry cough cold stuffy nose headache body ache malaise complete listlessness one feels that oh today i am going to just lie in bed not going to do anything fever loss of taste of the tongue and loss of smell of the nose these are the only symptoms so these are very very general symptoms i mean probably in a weeks time we will have monsoon in mumbai and in those four months each one of gets at least one episode when we go through these particular things now this year onwards with these symptoms we are going to see a doctor point number 1 point number 2 this is a pulse oximeter what you are saying this is a pulse oximeter so very small simple instrument i am going to switch it on so i have switched it on it has a screen and what i now do is put my finger inside and just hold on now you watch what happen it is reading the oxygen concentration of my finger can you see a graph is coming and it's a blue colored graph that is coming up and it will come out with figures it will give me two figures one figure is the heart rate is the pulse rate and the second figure is the oxygen concentration now this oxygen concentration that i have has to be in the range of 95 to 99 or even 100 whenever this concentration is less than is less than 94 it's a warning signal so in our family in our community in our building if we have a person who is above 55 who has those comorbidities and whose pulse oximeter readings are around 94 or less than that he must see a doctor so what zara asked thermometer is one thing which obviously all of us take and we take the temperature reading and this is second if you can now see my reading is 99 so i am all right so these are very very simple things that we can do to diagnose vulnerable group vulnerable people and give them the help